Hey, I am here with Tak Sasaki. Tak, how are you doing today? <laughs> I'm awesome. Excellent. I'm doing great, yes. Excellent. Can you tell us a little bit about your last fight? Uh, last fight was Chris Day. Um, yeah, it was a good fight. It was interesting. Uh, it was fun. Uh, it was exciting. I, you know, I went the distance, and I, I really wanted that out of that fight. You know, I really want to see how far it can go, because the first few fights before that, you know, first rounds and uh, second round was probably the farthest I've been, but the third round was nice to get in there, so it was good. Okay, excellent. And what was the finishing move of that fight? Finishing move? Oh, geez, it went to a decision, so it was, uh, it was a hands, hands raised. There you go, hands <laughs> raised. That's what it was. All right, why don't you tell us a little bit about what's in your future, what's coming up next? Uh, what's coming up next is, uh, well, right now my management is working on my first uh, pro debut fight in Abu Dhabi in Saudi Arabia. Congratulations. Thank you. Yeah, so it'll be for yeah, a league out there. I forget exactly which league. But uh, it's in the works right now, so they're working on that. So yeah, pro debut, so it's pretty cool. Training over in Montreal with GSP at TriStar. Could you give us a little insight to what that was like? That was uh, an amazing experience. Um, I wasn't training with GSP. We were training in the same room, same technique. You know, GSP is much heavier than I am myself, but I was fortunate to get instruction for Faraz Zahabi, his trainer. Uh, the help was amazing. He's just the wisdom he carries, and just the way he carries himself is really good. And uh, it was, and not just George. There was a lot of other top name fighters there out there as well. Um, there was like Miguel Torres was there, Kenny Florian was there at the time, um, Alex Garcia, uh, Joey Gambino, all, all these other fighters that are from from around the place. You know, it's a real mecca for MMA and especially for Canada. And again, the experience was amazing to be able to say, hey, you know, I'm, I'm here. And I'm training with these guys and I'm keeping up and it's pretty wild. So it was really good. I mean, the first week it was a bit starstruck, you know, of course, you know, I'm seeing all these guys that you'd see. But after that, you know, you have to put that stuff away or you're just going to keep getting beat up. And I, I did well. So it was an amazing experience. And uh, yeah, I have an open invitation back anytime. So I'm like kind of part of the team. So it's kind of cool. You know, that's wonderful, and that, that sort of training is priceless, really. Now, do you feel like this this is definitely has you prepared for heading into your professional career? Uh, yes, it does. Um, I'm also going to be going back there to do a training camp before my fight for, for that fight. So it's good that I got that opportunity and those resources. That, yeah, so it's nice. Yeah. Excellent. Well, Tax, thank you so much for your time. Is there anything else that you'd like to share or just a message you'd like to send out? I don't know, just keep shining the best and uh, yeah, just keep on going when it seems like it's, you know, you're down and out and feeling tough, you know, just look look for better days because they'll always come. So, thank you. All right. Thank you, Tack. Have a great night.